Good morning. We begin our Advent season with the theme, Being the Light of Hope. Hope is central to a healthy spiritual life, for without hope we can easily become indifferent, or worse, despairing about the world in which we live. Hope has been one of the central messages of our biblical story, often beautifully captured, as in this passage from Isaiah. Our first reading this morning is found in the second chapter of Isaiah, written during the fall of Israel to the Babylonians, resulting in exile. These were very dark times, and yet Isaiah speaks as a strong and steady voice of hope. Now reading Isaiah 2, verses 1 to 5. In the days to come, the mountain of God's house shall be established as the highest of mountains and shall be raised above the hills. All nations shall stream to it. Many people shall come and say, Come, let us go up to the mountain of God, that we may learn the ways of God, and that we may walk the path of God. For from God's mountain shall we go forth shall go forth the word, and love shall judge between the nations, and not shall be the way of many people. They shall beat their swords into plowshares, and their spears into pruning hooks. Nations shall not lift up sword against nation, neither shall they learn war anymore. Our second reading, found in Paul's letter to the church at Rome, encourages the followers to put on the armor of light, to be the light in a dark and dangerous world. As with much of Paul's teaching, how we do this is clear. It is to love, always love. Reading Romans 13, 8 and 11 to 14. Oh, no one anything except to love one another, for the one who loves another has fulfilled the law. Besides this, you know what time it is, how it is now the moment for you to awake from sleep, for salvation is nearer to us now than when we became believers. The night is far gone, the day is near. Let us that let us then lay aside the works of darkness and put on the armor of light. Let us live honorably as in the day. Put on the Lord Jesus Christ. Hear what the Spirit is saying to the church. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. Thanks, May. 